Last night, the city saw its latest teen takeover, this time in Lakeview. Yeah, a mob of teens filled the streets, climbing onto cars, damaging the vehicles and businesses in the neighborhood. There was Kelly Davis has more. People tell me hundreds of teens poured off the L here at the Belmont Red Line stop. They swarmed the streets and caused chaos throughout the neighborhood. This is the scene that unfolded just after 10 o'clock last night. Hundreds of teens took to the streets, shutting down Belmont for hours. There was no celebration yesterday. It was just pure chaos. Roddy Hashish is the manager of the Slice Shop. The restaurant just steps from the Belmont Red Line stop was surrounded. He shared this video he took from inside the store of teens dancing on cars and drinking in the streets. Right away we decided to close both uh, the store and the restaurant and we just we stayed all night watching making sure nobody broke in or you know nobody vandalized our business. CPD officers worked to control the crowd and move them out of the area but the teens left behind a path of destruction. People were horrified by the extent of the damage this morning. Shoe prints on cars, hoods dented, windshields broken. It's terrifying. It's terrifying. Grace Rowan said she even heard gunshots and was too scared to leave her apartment. It has been very chaotic and as somebody who's lived in Lakeview for honestly the past three years, it's very scary to see how things have changed over time. People are hoping the city steps up to prevent this from happening again. Alderman Bennett Lawson helped with cleanup this morning. He released a statement saying, quote, I will be meeting with the 19th District Police, CTA, and others to discuss what took place and identify ways we can prevent it from occurring moving forward, as well as continue conversations with my colleagues on City Council about how we can keep our youth from participating in these disruptive actions. We all simply love Lakeview, and to see others coming in and not respecting your community the same way that you do is really upsetting. Chicago police arrested two people, including a 15 year old girl. She has been charged with aggravated assault of a first responder, resisting and obstructing traffic. Reporting from Lakeview, I'm Kelly Davis, WGN News.